Welcome back to the farm. Some time has passed and it's now mid-June. Our crops are looking pretty good. These are our small garbanzo beans or billy beans. We've had a lot of rain, cool temperatures, which plants love, but fungus also loves it. So we've been spraying for stripe rust in the wheat. And then right now we're spraying our garbage for estacida blight. So see this patch right here? What happens is you get a lot of rainy, cool weather and this fungus attacks your garbanzo beans and it starts showing up in little patches and it moves pretty quickly. And it causes these kind of black lesions on the stems of the plant and chokes off all the different uh, leaves that are out there. And so you gotta treat it pretty quickly when it starts showing up and only takes a few days to really mess up your field. So my brother's spraying right now and I'm just kind of out scouting for where we've got a little bit of a, a grassy weed issue on the border of this field. We're just seeing how much of it we might need to treat or just kind of kill out the whole crop uh, just to get rid of that grassy weed so it doesn't move through the whole field. But uh, anyway, beautiful evening out on the farm and, and uh, I'm filling up the water truck, but I'm also watching the crop duster. He's out here spraying some of our spring wheat. Since I'm down here in a draw, I don't get to see him actually hitting our wheat, but what I do see is uh, when he comes almost right over my head and is heading to our field that's just up over the hill past our 10,000 gallon water tank that's here at this developed spring. So. see him turn on the chemical yep so a nice evening out on the farm here in later part of June it's very green out but we are spraying basically our spring wheat for fungus so we got a fungicide in there we're also spraying insecticide because we're getting lots of aphids out there anyway ah nice evening when it cools down Remember to like and subscribe.